chapter nine. <laughs> so chapter nine starts off with Scout getting extremely angry because Cecil Jacobs told her that Atticus defends Peters in court. Scout denied that but talked to Jim about it. Atticus defends Tom Robinson, a black man who was accused of raping a white woman. The woman victim, Mayella, is a member of the Ewell family. He is the member of Calpurnia's church, and Atticus said that Calpurnia knows his family very well. The Robinsons are clean living folks, and Atticus tells Scout that lawyers have at least one case in their lifetime that affects them personally. This would be the case that affects Atticus personally. He tells her to not let the kids at school upset her. Even though Atticus is not going to win the case, he's going to take the case anyway to prove to everybody that black people have the same rights just like everybody else. Not everybody agrees. No matter what color you are, you're still a human being. Cecil Jacobs is a bully to scout at school the next day. He said that Atticus is a disgrace to make home, and he tells Scout that she's a coward, all because Scout has made a promise to Atticus to walk away and not fight with him. Scout did all that she could to walk away from that bully. Every Christmas, Scout remembers her Uncle Jack visiting the Finches at Maycomb Junction and he would spend a week with them. Scout and Jim received an air rifle and a chemistry set for Christmas from Atticus and he would give them lessons on how to shoot. See you on the next episode of To Kill Mockingbird.